I drank a lot of Diet Coke today. I did a lot of Coke today. I did a lot of cock today. Hey, this is 10% luck, 20% skill, 15% concentrated power of will, 5% pleasure, 50% pain, and 100% reason to remember the name. Today we're doing the book cover Olympics. We're going to be voting on book covers for all of the books that I've chosen are books that I love. So there's no bias there on my part. All the books I've chosen are books that they haven't read. He's too old to read Young Adult and too gay to be a real male perspective. And I'm just too dumb. <laughs> Our first book is Getting Revenge on Lauren Wood. Wing! I love that the dolls sitting there are all tranquil while she's getting a knife in her back. The only thing I'd say that's bad about it is it seems a little bland to me. Our next book is You by Charles Benoit. That's a 666. Well, why did I write The Number of the Devil? We all know what red <laughs> resembles. Blood, fire, anger, ketchup. ketchup. I gave you a three, and let me tell you why. <laughs> all these quotes are really distracting, and they're terrible, and they take away from the, from the cover. Our next book is The Death Day Letter by Sean David Hutchinson. The only thing I don't love about this cover is I'm not crazy about the way that the letter wraps around because I don't like how it ends up back here. And I think it's a really strong image with the letter right on the cover. The next book we have is The Perks of Being a Wallflower by Stephen Chbosky. Judges! I love this face. You can give me a white book. This is possibly my favorite book in the universe and my least favorite cover. I hate the little pants in the corner. Pretty unique. I haven't really seen anything like this. A little dated. So now for a completely impartial final book we are doing I'm sure this will turn out lovely. Judges, reveal your scores! I have to draw the line, okay? And I just have to draw a line and then a zero, obviously. <laughs> I'm married to this girl. Listen, if you don't support your wife in writing, listen, I had to give her a 10. Um, I just gave my cover a smiley face because I love it. I would make out with it if it were would not constitute sexual harassment of this poor model. I gave this book a piece of Swiss cheesecake. That's cheesecake made out of Swiss cheese, so it's got the holes in it. Really, when you're looking for a cover, you want something that's gonna stand out. She's banging. <laughs> Do her. Cut that out. <laughs> we determined that Swiss cheesecake doesn't actually exist, which means that Invincible Summer must sadly be disqualified. My conclusion from this video is that boys' tastes do not reliably differ from girls' tastes, which is yet another reason not to stereotype based on gender. Woo! I'm glad that we came to that conclusion, as it is my favorite conclusion in the entire universe. And I hope that you are having a fabulous week, and I will see you next week when I will be back on Tuesday. Bye! Is it recording now? Yeah, it is. Nice. It's been recording this whole time. I've been secretly masturbating. Oh, yeah!